All my bad boys fans, man, stand up because the production because it's coming, y'all. It's coming. Progress on Bad Boys for Life seems to be moving forward in the film. We could have started filming in early 2019. Man, I haven't waited 15 years for this, cause I, so I cannot wait to see this straight up. Now, as I just mentioned, it's been 15 years since the last Bad Boys movie, you know, which centered around Will Smith and Martin Lawrence playing some good-ass Miami detectives. Now, it's been in development hell since 2019, so that's why we really haven't got anything. Now, while both the, birth, the first two buddy cops cop movies were seen as a financial success. Only the first one did well with critics. I mean, I don't, okay, well, fuck the damn critics as long as you made money. Truth be told. The second one received mostly negative reviews, which has no doubt played a hand in the delay of the third movie. I wouldn't give a fuck what critics say about my damn movie as long as the fans want it. You know, I would do it. And as long as it makes financial success, I will do it. Straight up. I'm just That's just how I am. And, and just because I'd be passionate enough to make the movie. Like, I, especially if I love the movie, I'll do it. And I'm passionate about acting, so. Over the years, the project has been going through several writers, including Safe House's David Guggerheim, John Harnahan, Carnahan, who is also in talks to direct, and most recently, Chris Brimmer, Brimner. This year seemed to have been a good year for the franchise since the Bad Boys spinoff TV series was originally ordered by NBC, but like I mentioned before, but later canceled during production. And that's for some fucked up ass shit. To do that. And because Sony gave Bad Boys for Life a 2020 release date. Now the project seems to be continuing to make progress. With news about a possible filming date. Now. As reported by Variety. The script by Brim- Brimner appears to have been approved by Sony. Which means filming on Bad Boys for Life could potentially begin by early 2019. Even though Sony has yet to comment about the filming start date. Sometime in early 2019 sounds right if the studio hopes to release the film in 20, January 2020. And in an earlier interview with Variety, Columbia Pictures president Sanford Panich mentioned that, and I quote, If we're going to make another Bad Boys after 15 years, it's got to be next level great. End quote. And I completely agree, man. It, it's got to, it most likely will be great as long as you see the two titular characters, Marcus Burnett. And Michael and Mike Lowry. So as long as you guys get you got those guys, it'll be pretty damn good, man. For many fans, in order to have a Bad Boys three be next level great, both Smith and Lawrence will need to return. Smith is on board for the sequel, as he was recently reported that he will make film Bad Boys for Life Before Bright two and Suicide Squad two. And you know all three, you know mentioning those three movies in the same way, man. I gotta be honest with you, all three of them were great. I don't, I don't know about you guys, but I enjoyed Bright. And I enjoyed Suicide Squad. However, Lawrence, on the other hand, has still not signed on for the movie. He has previously remained hopeful for another film in the series, but last year, Lawrence revealed that he didn't think Bad Boys 3 was going to happen at all. I mean, that's not too bad. I mean, as long as he now knows, like, hey, we got, we, got, we got a great script, because he always mentioned in interviews, as long as the script is great, you know, and everyone's on board, he'll do it. So, I'm pretty sure he'll, he's on board to do it now, man. While the sequel has its ups and downs, Sony has tried to make the third <laughs> film before. When the first Bad Boys came out in 95, man, the year I was born, that is dope. Smith was still a rising star, making his appearance in Bad Boys 2 much easier to accomplish than it is now. I wish I wouldn't have waited so damn long, honestly. I mean, maybe like 10 years, that would have been great, but... Alright, so Smith has grown to become incredibly... Sought after actor appearing in big pictures over the years, including recently in movies such as Bright and Suicide Squad. Lawrence took a break from acting in 2014, but nobody can blame him for having doubts about returning to a series that hasn't made progress in the last 15 years, and has no doubt been a struggle to get the cast and filmmakers together to make Bad Boys for Life. But it may happen soon, and thank goodness it is. Thank goodness. But here's the key release date, y'all. Bad Boys for Life releases 2020. January 17th. This has been your boy, Shaver Speaks. Are you guys excited about Bad Boys for Life? I damn sure am, as you can tell. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you guys have any requests or something, what videos you guys want me to do next, please let me know in the comment section below. Or feel free to message me, private message me on the backs of my YouTube page. This has been your boy, Shaver Speaks. I love you guys. God bless.